Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. I think this is why I always have an affinity to my peers because I know the truth. Mm -hmm. I know what it takes and all it takes is for you to believe mm -hmm. in yourself. And that sounds so damn cheesy mm -hmm. because we hear that all of our lives. But seriously, life is a fucking fairy tale. Believe in you. Yeah. Gotta believe. You gotta believe in you. Yeah. Hey guys, good morning y'all, it's your good day and I'm back for another video. Before I get into the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, turn your post notifications so you never miss a video. If you are like 13 seconds into my video and have not liked, comment, and subscribe, something wrong with you, you're a hater, I said what I said, you're a hater, if you haven't subscribed yet. You're a hater and I don't need that type of negativity on my channel, like... But anyways, y'all, um, I'm coming on here to uh, give y'all a last update. So, the previous video y'all saw yesterday, which will be Wednesday. Today is actually Tuesday. I'm pre-recording this video. Um, so, y'all might see me in the same outfit, depending on how I feel. But you all, I came in here... Um, So, tell you guys that I'm getting bariatric surgery. Uh, most people know this. Some people don't know this. Um, I have said it a couple of times on my channel, but it hasn't been really let out. Um, now that I did a lot of prayer a lot of understanding, a lot of asking God to guide me on what he wants me to do. And it's dropping in my spirit that I need to do this, that I need to, to record my journey for someone else, to support someone else that's in my journey. Um... So, I decided to get the surgery. Um, it's going on two years now. 2020, 20, 20, 2019. 2018, actually. Um, it was before my cousin passed and before my aunt passed. I had decided it. Um, a lot of factors played into it. Um, she, she was like a big factor into it, of why I decided to get the surgery, and why it was necessary for me to get the surgery. So, I decided to start the surgery in October of 2018. Now, I started, I had to debate up in my mind as soon as my cousin passed away when his situation happened. It was in my mind. I'm getting the surgery. I called. Like. I had called. In October 2018. Um, I had called. They couldn't get me until February 2019. So. But I had called. Um, and I started the process. I started the journey. 2019. I did not keep up with the journey. I did not, you know, I was like, I'm not going to get this surgery. I'm just not. My aunt had passed. I had dropped out of high college and saw my cousin. And I'm, like, I'm just not going to get it, you know. I'm young. I'm not going to get it. I could figure it out myself. Keep eating. It wasn't until this past June or July. It was just like, this is hard. And, I mean, it's going to be hard when I get my surgery, but it's even hard now. And it was like, go ahead and get it. So, I started the process again in June. By June, so I have my insurance required me. Well, one of my insurances, I have two insurances. One of my insurances required me 
<sighs> to go six months in the program. Six months would have been February. Well, will be February of 2021, which is crazy because I started this process in February, October of 2018. Had my first court appointment in February of 2019 when my aunt passed away. It's just crazy. Well, it's just it's overly crazy how things just circle of life. So, in between the two years, I started my business. I was in my teacher was so proud of me. I started my business. I. It's just crazy how the cycle circle of life, like, you know, she was so proud of me. You know, she's like, I wish I would have got this surgery. I wish I would have, you know, you do it. You do it for you if nobody else. And so, yeah, you all. Um, I ended up getting the surgery. I am getting the surgery. I've been through the process. It's a lot that comes out of it. It's not an easy walk in the park at all. You got to watch what you eat. You got to calorie count what you eat. Make sure you're eating enough protein. People think when you get the surgery or when you're planning to get the surgery or something that it's easy walk in the park. And it's really not. You're taking the easy way out. And you're really not. This is an aid to help you lose weight. This is not a, oh, you get the surgery. You're going to automatically lose weight, you know. Um, I feel like my my journey has helped my, my mom and other people be like, yeah, I'm going to go get my surgery. I'm going to get my surgery now. I'm going to, you know, get the compensation. And that makes me proud because obesity and things, it's a generational curse, you all. It's a generational curse. You're always thinking about old teen pregnancy and um homelessness and other things but you have to understand the obesity and people that are not obese the people that are um skinny too skinny um it's a generational curse your weight is a generational curse now i'm not by all means oh my god i am not saying that you're not gonna be plus size with a b plus i wouldn't be getting it but it's the difference between being plus size and being a healthy plus size you know i'm 20 I shouldn't have be having high blood pressure and I shouldn't be having risk of diabetes and thinking about, you know, sleep apnea and things of that nature. I shouldn't. I just shouldn't. I want to live, not die. Like, I want my babies. I want to have kids. I want my kids to see my mama lost all of this weight just so I could have them or lost all of this weight for me type thing, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just... Oof, mind blown. I am mind blown. It's like... I don't think I would make it this far. That's why I haven't said anything, really. I don't think I would make it, because every time I say I'm going to do it, I... The first time I said I was going to do it, I didn't, but I'm in November, damn near, and I have my ultrasound. Uh, my the GI is, like, getting closer and closer. Like, in November, I got my psycho psychological, um, my, psycho my psychological evaluation, and I meet with the dietitian, and I meet with the surgeon. It's, like, all sinking in. It's sinking in. It's October, and it's, like, my November, sis. But February be here, I, it's like it's just going by so fast, y'all. And it's so crazy because I remember I made a video last year on my birthday for my pictures. I said something gonna change. Then this is like the, the changing point in my life. And my birthday last year was a changing point in my life. Like I lost so many people. I gained a couple of people, but I'm working hard and I'm grinding to be the best me possible. Consistency is key, y'all. Consistent, 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 consistent. Y'all, if y'all ready for this journey, um, I hope this helps somebody, like anybody out there. Because, you know, I, these videos are probably going to be, in my mind, I'm thinking these videos are going to probably help 
the future people like you know there are so people that are afraid or that are very afraid to share their journey and for some reason i'm not convicted but i feel like i need to share my journey because there's i wish i had this like you know you google on youtube you know bariatric journey for young people you already had that you know uh, it's like people don't want me to finish this video. It's like I said, I finish this video. They want to call. <laughs> they want to call me. I said, I want to finish this video. It's like, as soon as I start one phone ring, as soon as I'm going to see another phone ring, as soon as I'm going to another phone ring, I'm sick of it. So sick of it, bro. Like, I want to finish this video. But yeah, like I was saying. I wish I had, um, I wish I had, I wish I had somebody to, someone my age to go through the journey with me because there's not a lot, if you Google a lot of young, you know, young people with bariatric surgery, there's nothing really on YouTube. So, yeah, um, so yeah, make sure, I'm gonna finish this video now before I get another call. So make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe and turn your post notifications so you never miss a video. Also, if you are interested in getting very extra surgery, comment down below. Like, you know, share your journey a little bit, you know. And I'll talk to you guys later. Deuces. Bye. As I've told you time and time again, you have the ability to accomplish anything that you desire. You're special, sweetie. And God wants to do great things through me. What you believe becomes what they see. See your reflection in the mirror. May it always be a pretty girl.